Hi everyone, thank you for watching Access Hockey Michigan. Today we joined Detroit Red Wings goaltending prospect Caden Fulcher, who's been assigned to their ECHL affiliate, the Toledo Walleye. He's hoping, as a rookie, to learn under veteran goaltender Pat Nagel in his first rookie campaign of his pro career. Caden Fulcher is one of the most promising prospects Detroit has currently working up through the system and is hoping to land a spot with the Griffins before long. So keep watching and see what Caden has to say about his first pro season with the Toledo Walleye. We're here with Caden Fulcher, a recent selection for the Detroit Red Wings. And Caden, I just want to talk about your experience coming up here, um, getting getting the call from Detroit and what that whole your, your summer's been like with that through training camp and the prospect tournament. Describe to me a little bit about that. Yeah, it's definitely been uh, pretty busy, obviously, but I think uh, just uh, getting an early start to the season has uh, really helped me, I think, uh, going through all those camps and uh, especially a lot of it with Pat Nagel. So it was kind of yeah. nice to uh, meet him and uh, meet, meet some of the guys on the team here and uh, kind of get that relationship going. Now, what are you looking forward to most learning from Pat? Because he's, he's an experienced goaltender. He's been here for a while. He's got a very proven track record. You know, what are you going to try to draw from him as you learn underneath him this season? Uh, I think just his calmness. I think uh, you just watch him in the net even during practice and it's, uh, it's pretty unbelievable just how calm he is in the net. He doesn't <laughs> let anything phase him. So I think if I can uh, calm my down, calm my uh, game down, and uh, watch his hands and uh, pick up on that, I think uh, I'm going to be a pretty good goalie. Right, right. Control it a little bit more. Yeah, and yeah. Not get too worked up yeah, or anything. Yeah. And we talked to Brian Mahoney Wilson back in Grand Rapids, and he's super pumped about you and your your potential. What does that do for your confidence, knowing that you've got all these coaches and all this staff that's got your back and they they believe in you? Does that change how you approach the game every night? Yeah, I think definitely. I think uh, Beamer's a great guy, and obviously the relationship we have is a, is a pretty good one, obviously. And I think uh, just knowing you got a whole organization behind you is, uh, is definitely big for not only your confidence, but mm -hmm. just uh, kind of knowing, you know, uh, their plan is for me to work my way up. And I think that uh, makes you work a little bit harder and uh, push a little more in practice just to make sure you don't, uh, don't disappoint those guys. Mm -hmm, absolutely. And what are you planning on doing differently this season? So coming out of the, the OHL, um, you know, obviously it's a, it's a different type of game. It's, you know, it's, the, the culture's completely different. What are you looking to do to adapt your game to the way things are now? Are you changing your workouts or, you know, I don't know, is it your schedule or anything like that that, that you're going to be adjusting? Yeah, yeah, I think just making sure you get to the rink uh, tons mm -hmm. of time uh, in advance and uh, making sure you're always prepared for every practice, kind of treat it like a game. Mm -hmm. uh, obviously, being the young guy, you know, you never know how many starts you're going to get right away. So I think it's, uh, it's just treating every practice like a game, uh, coming into it 100% uh, effort and 100% uh, prepared. Mm -hmm. And outside of Pat, are there any other, you know, players or even just outside influences in your life that really impact how you play the game and your confidence, whether it's on or off the ice? Yeah, yeah, I think a lot of it has to do with your family, obviously, mm -hmm. and uh, just uh, bouncing ideas off them. And uh, obviously, it's nice when the girlfriend gets down to watch a mm -hmm. game or two. And I think uh, just the guys in the room are just unbelievable. I mm -hmm. think uh, it's it's you never know what you're going to step into when you're a rookie. But I think uh, with this team, it's it's uh, it's pretty fun, and it's uh, you're starting to feel like a family. Mm -hmm. And now, what about you? Do you feel like impacts the team the most? What can you bring uniquely to the team? I think just uh, coming in uh, positive every day. I think uh, being a good good guy in the locker room, and I think. Uh, just uh, every time I get a chance to be in the net, I think just giving it my all and uh, always battling. Mm -hmm. Just enjoying it yeah, as much yeah, as you possibly can. Yeah, just living can. in the moment. 